What am I up to today? I have a very small project. So let me show you what I'm going to do. You may remember I got a green stock and I put plants in it, but I have five, I had six holes that didn't have a plant. Now I only have five because I stuck a, t a potato in one of them to see what that would do. So my goal right now, instead of putting my seeds in the green stock to come up, let me move you back here a little bit so you can see what I'm doing. Uh, a little further, hold on. Let me adjust this. So instead of direct seeding into the green stock, I wanted to have a little more control because I don't always make sure, well right now the green stock is staying nice and wet and I know seeds have to stay wet when they're planted, but I wanted to make sure that I was in full control of it. So I'm going to plant them in a six pack here and then when they get, oh, you know, a little tall. I don't have to let them grow out as much as if I were going to put them out in the ground. But, you know, as soon as they're a little bit tall, then I'll transplant them into the green stock. So since I only had, well, I only have four, no, five. I had six, I now have five. Five holes to cover up. Okay, one of the things I made sure that I wanted was celery. <laughs> Can you see that? Celery. And so one of my one of my cells in my six pack here is gonna have celery in it. And let me put some celery seeds in my hand here. That's more than well, okay, way more than enough. I'll put those back in there. These are real small, so I'm gonna. Okay. And those will go back in my. Some of those didn't go in the container, but at least they're contained in my <laughs> in my little bowl here. I'll have to clean that up. Maybe I'll throw those out and somewhere where they'll I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. That didn't quite go as planned. Okay, I also want some parsley. I used to have some parsley in my in my garden, but it has long since been not there anymore. Okay, parsley. I won't pour, pour so much of it out. There, that's better. <laughs> Parsley's gonna go in this one. I have a few more seeds than I probably need. Cross that bridge when we come to it. Okay. So I've got celery and parsley. Oh, and I didn't show you the parsley sack. Parsley. Okay. Next I'm going to do some nasturtiums. And I only have five nasturtium seeds here. I'm going to plant all five of them. These are a little bit on the old side. And packed for 2021, so 
Those are bigger, so I'm going to push them down into the... There, and then make sure they're covered up. Okay. So that's three. And I want some bush beans. These are Romano bush beans. Since I did five of the nasturtiums, I'm going to do, let's see how many, I'm not sure how many. I only have one, two, three, four, six and a half seeds in there. I'm not sure that half seed's going to do anything. I'll plant all of these too. If I get more, if they all, if they all sprout, I've got places out in the garden and put some of them. Actually, I'm just going to plant four. That's perfect. Okay. Four. Okay. This will go back in a sec. This was the free seed that I got with my green stock basil. I'm going to plant some of that. seeds and the parsley and, and celery seeds were all very little, very itsy bitsy. So I just lay it on top and kind of push them so that they, so they make contact. Okay, I have one cell left. I'm going to put, gosh, I've got two things here. I've got some leek seeds and some marigold seeds. I think I will do the leek seeds. These can be planted in with on the same um, the same pocket as some of the other plants when whenever they come up. Okay, so that takes care of that. These marigold seeds I'm gonna have my hubby kind of spread them around out in the actual totes in the garden. So, all right. Need to do something with these celery seeds. Okay. What kind of celery was that? It was Utah celery. And I I think I've got most of it here. Well you don't need to see me suffering doing that. Okay, I'm gonna put these up on the table. And they need a little bit of water in the top. They're sitting in some water that will come up through the bottom. But I'll get them watered. And they're planted. Grow little plants. 
Bro. And before I go, I thought I'd show you my my tree, my mulberry tree. It acted like it was dead, but it finally pushed leaves. So that's it for today's project. I did notice on my green stalk, uh, some of those strawberries that we planted had strawberries on them. I noticed one is getting red. So I'm gonna have Hubby check it to see if it needs to be picked. I will let him pop it into his mouth if it is, or he might let me, who knows. Well, that's it for today. I pray that God's love and blessings surround you. I'll see you on my next video. Well, there was a ripe strawberry. I let Hubby have the first bite and there's a couple of views of it. Pretty, pretty strawberry.